I have a friend who's like 27 and she's really excited to go to the Taylor Swift show because like she grew up with her. I can't think of like any other artist that like that that is at that level. Yeah, like, yeah because you, like, you have to have the longevity. Right. Still yeah. be relevant. She probably and... started listening to her when she was 10, 11 right. years old and right. now she's I think I was 20... a sophomore in high school. When I yeah. yeah. yeah when, I mean, when Tim McGraw came out, something like that. Maybe is Tim McGraw your Taylor Swift? No, that's her. The, her first like hit was called oh, Tim McGraw. Oh, it's called Tim McGraw. Yeah, I thought you were Tim McGraw. <laughs> Tim McGraw. My, my mom loved Tim McGraw. One time she, the one time she got away from because uh, like, she worked got away, shit. Was like, she yeah, 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 we had her in a basement. Um, <laughs> <laughs> she worked like uh, she was a nurse. She worked crazy hours, but she had like one vacation when I was a kid to go see Tim McGraw and Faith Hill. She went with yeah. like my grandmother. They're married, like, right? I think. So. Yes. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. She went to like Pennsylvania to go see her that weekend. I was like ten years old. And uh, my dad had a, a PS2. This was like probably 2006, 2007. And I loved uh, the Battlefront games, Star Wars mm. Battlefront, the OG. So, and but I was not allowed to play them on his PlayStation. And so I would delete the data right after I was done playing it. And he was really into that game, Blitz, the he, league he, yeah, yeah. that just would cheat all the time, mm -hmm. just aggravate. And I accidentally he had like maybe 60 hours invested in that game and I deleted it by accident. And then I just, after I did that, I just went upstairs and I was like, I'm just going to pretend I don't know what happened. Totally. Yeah. Totally. I woke up to him. He grabbed me by the yeah. chest. <laughs> and the next thing I knew, I was downstairs on the couch with his foot on my chest. And then I just got the worst ass beating of my life. I used to be much darker. All the black came off of me that day. I went from one day this kid's going to have a hard time with the cops to he looks like he has good credit. And my mom came home being like, I got you all this guys from all this stuff from the Tim McGraw concert, which made the weekend even worse because I didn't give a fuck about Tim McGraw. Now I got this. It's like when they brought Dasani to those people in Houston when the power went out. Like, now they got to boil the water again. It doesn't matter. This sucks. Yeah. Tim McGraw for some, sorry, that was a trauma dump. You said Tim McGraw, and I was like, speaking of Tim McGraw, here's this time my dad beat the shit out of me. <laughs> that did not connect you ever at seen all. Friday Night Lights? Kind of like that. Yeah, I walked in talking about molested, and we're getting glory hold by the Pope. This is great. I love the Vatican. This is so great. This is like that 70s show, but only hide. <laughs> Nobody Dude, feels safe. The, the fucking fact that your dad oh, had a so. video game system. And, like that's like the meanest thing I ever heard. That like like it's one thing if your dad doesn't let you do things. You but, like, can't play the video like, games. You can't, you're yeah. a child and you can't play with the toys. We like, had a GameCube and that was supposed to make us be okay. Uh, GameCube. We, we were like you have the GameCube, you'll be fine. And I'm like, how many fucking times can I play Mario Sunshine? I want to yeah. play San Andreas. I'm yeah, ten. GTA, I don't yeah. care. I want to yeah. kill a hooker with a katana. <laughs> that urge never goes away if you don't satisfy it at ten. Yo, if you have a kid out there, make sure he's playing as many violent video games as he can before puberty. Big Otherwise, those son. wires get crossed and he ends up in the NFL. <laughs> big, basically. <laughs> All right, big thanks for watching. If you made it through this whole episode, that means you should be subscribed. There's so many of you out there who watch and don't subscribe, so make sure you are a KFC Radio subscriber. Make sure you get all the content when it drops. Click that button now. I have nine fingers. I'm still subscribed. It's that easy.